What's going on, everyone? Mike go back, and today I'll be ripping the Rookie Card Explosion Box, Volume 7 by Filmington. This is a fun repack product. It's a blast. The whole point of this product is seeking out key rookie cards. It's put out by Filmington. You can check out his YouTube channel at the link down below. Phil does a great job on his channel. I certainly recommend you check it out, and I recommend the Rookie Card Explosion Box. It's a lot of fun. Gives you a mix of stuff. A few older packs, some modern packs, new packs. It's a chance to seek out some hot rookie cards. It's always fun to crack some packs. It's fun if you're into grading and stuff to uh, have a chance to get some pack fresh stuff. So we will go through this. Pull out all these packs. A few more on the bottom. And as you can see, it's a nice mix. Now we got a few packing peanuts. We'll put them aside, including a few extras. So Phil does a great job, like I said, mixing up the products, changing up the different um, selection of packs each time, and gives you an amazing list that lets you know what you are seeking, what you have a chance to get. So if I can get it open, you can take a look at it. So this rookie card explosion box includes 1981 Donners, 85 Donners, 93 Tops, 2008 Bowman Chrome, 2013 Tops Update, 2015 Tops Update, 2016 Chrome, 2017 Chrome, 2017 Tops Update, 2018 Tops Heritage High Number, 2018 Tops Update, and 2019 Tops Series 2. Gives you a bunch of information. This is where you can find additional information via Facebook, YouTube, or the Rookie Card Explosion Box website. And here's a look at the key rookies. You get a chance to see them. 81 Donners, Tim Raines, and Danny Ainge. 85 Donners, Clemens, Puckett, Hershiser, and so on and so forth. Obviously, tons of key rookies in the modern products as well. Should be an absolute blast and a lot of fun. So let's get set up here. And let's get into Kraken. Looks like we got a bonus pack there. So we'll put that down towards the bottom. We're going to do this in chronological order. We'll start with 1981 Donruss. This is where we're looking for the Tim Raines. Got a chance at Danny Ainge as well. The old school wax pack. Should be a lot of fun. So let's take a look at it. Oh, look at that. Some super, super old gum, which is totally stuck to Rusty's card. There we go. That is a brittle piece of gum. So there's 81 Donners. Definitely looks like a card from the 80s for sure. Early 80s. Vern Rule. Pete Lecoq. Robin Yon, that's a nice one there, nice Hall of Famer. As you can see, certainly off-center, but that's pretty cool. Put that aside. Joe Nolan, Chet Lemon, Nolan Ryan, another Hall of Famer. Again, these old-school cards definitely have a little more in terms of centering issues, maybe some rough edges, but fun to pull them. Marty Patton, Del Alston. Dan Droysen, Rich Dotson, Alan Ashby, Victor Cruz, Jay Johnstone, Britt Burns. Look at that guy. I don't know if that would fly that look in Major League Baseball nowadays. It's a nice Art Howe, longtime manager. And Jamie Quirk. So there's our look at 81 Donruss. Fun blast from the past. Put them aside, hit two Hall of Famers, so that was pretty cool. All right, next up, we have 1985 Donners. This one, you have Roger Clemens, Kirby Puckett, and Oral Hershiser. And there we go with the back card with the wax stains. These are certainly sensitive cards with their black borders. All right. Pedro Guerrero, John Franco, had a really nice career. Dave Anderson, 
Lee Mazzilli, Don Slot, Mulliganess, Tony Pena, Carney Lansford, some nice Diamond Kings, David Palmer, Ron Romanick, Doyle Alexander, Dave Parker, fantastic player, Don Baylor, another really good player, Bill Campbell, and Rick Cerrone. So, fun little rip there with the 85. Nothing too crazy, though. We got 1993 tops. Of course, in this, you're looking for Derek Jeter. Derek Jeter, who will be elected to the Hall of Fame next year. Let's see what we get in the pack of 93. One of those early cards where you had a little more gloss to them, some pictures on the back. A little fancier than the cardboard stuff from a couple years prior. Kevin Seitzer. Brett Butler. Kevin Campbell. Eric Anthony. He was a big prospect at one point. Reggie Sanders. All rookie team. We got a gold parallel of Todd Hundley. He had some phenomenal seasons with the Mets. Bob Malacki. Henry Cotto. Lenny Webster, Dave Valle, Robbie Thompson, John Haven, Frank Tanana, really good autograph signer through the mail, Alejandro Pena, and Dwayne Ward. So shut out from a major rookie again. All right, 2008 Bowman Chrome. This one you have a chance for Justin Turner, Joey Votto, Evan Longoria, and Carlos Santana. Got a shot for some autographs as well. It's not every day you get a 2008 product to rip. So, we start off with Alex Gordon. Nice player. There's a nice uh, Justin Verlander, earlier Verlander card. Does have a little scratch there, though that might just be a uh, slight roller mark with some kind of oil that you can... Kind of wiped down, so we'll see. I'll put that one aside. Anthony Vavaro, first Bowman Chrome card and possibly his last. And Mitch Keenum, another guy who did not make it, or at least has not made it. So that's 2008 Bowman Chrome. Next up, we have 2013 Tops Update Series. 2013 Update features... Christian Yelich, Nolan Arenado, Anthony Rendon, Yasiel Puig, Didi Gregorius, and Garrett Cole. So a loaded update set. Update has just been exploding in popularity. Of course, you can get color parallels as well. So we start off with Jason Giambi as a Cleveland Indian. Ryan Kalish at the wall. There you go, Didi Gregorius. That's a nice one there. He's the lesser... He He's one of the lesser guys on that list, but still really good player. So that's a nice one. Put that aside. Mike Carp. Cody Allen. Craig Kimbrell. Insert. Got a David Freeze, Postseason Heroes. It's a nice card. Preston Claiborne. Nate Jones. And Ty Wigginton. Ty Wigginton. So, we did hit one of the rookies on the list, so definitely happy about that with the D.D. Gregorius. Next up, we have 2015 Tops Update. This one is another one loaded with rookies. Francisco Lindor's the biggest one. You got Chris Bryant as well. Carlos Correa. Joey Gallo is having a great year. Byron Buxton. Jock Peterson. Noah Syndergaard. Eddie Rosario. Matt Boyd and Tommy Pham. Those are some of the key rookies that have a shot at hitting in this one. So let's check out 2015 Tops Update. And we start off with this dude, Danny Muno. So we're getting some rookies, just not the rookies we're looking for. Ben Revere. Ursula. Got an insert here of Dwight Gooden. Jake Peavy. Chris Sale, All-Star Game card. Alex Rodriguez, 300 or 3,000 hits highlight. Vinny Pistano, pretty sure this dude had a uh, 
little shout out in How I Met Your Mother, if I remember. He was a Indian for quite a while. And John Axford. So that's a 2015 update. Moving on to 2016 Tops Chrome. This one, you have base cards of Corey Seager, Trevor Story, Trey Turner, Mondesi, Keto Marte, Gary Sanchez, Rick Snell, Aaron Nola, Jose Berrios. And, of course, you have Chance for Autographs as well. So, is this a little hot pack? I think this is a hot pack with the black parallels. Rosny Castillo, who was a big disappointment. We've got Brad Ziegler, who had a nice career there for a few years. We've got a Byron Buxton Future Stars. And then a... Rob Ref Snyder. So we did get refractors. We got a hot pack with the black parallels, but unfortunately, none of the big time stars. 2017 Tops Chrome. This one you have base cards of Cody Bellinger, Aaron Judge, Alex Bregman, Andrew Benatendi, and Yon Makata. Also a chance for autographs as well. I believe there might be some variations as well. So we start off with Gene Carlos Stanton. Got a refractor of Jonas Cespedes. Nice card. Got a Xander Bogart's base. And a Matt Carpenter. So, like I said, this product, this repack product, is just a lot of fun. A nice mixture of different cards and something to hunt. And you're not going to win every time. If you check out other videos, you'll see some people who just do really well. And they hit some of these key rookies, which is awesome. And by the way, we got 2017 Update Series. Uh, with with base cards of Cody Bellinger, Matt Chapman, Luke Voigt, Judge, Bregman, Benatendi, Mancata, DeJong, Luis Castillo, and Josh Hader. Repchinski, Taiwan Walker, Joaquin Benoit. We've got a Chris Archer All-Star Game card. Yadi Molina All-Star. Irvin Santana. Shout out to... My man, Wesker Griff, his boy, Andrew Knapp. There's a Cody, Cody Bellinger. It's a home run derby rookie, so, or home run derby cards, so not really the one you're looking for, but it's cool. Corey Knievel and Aaron Judge, rookie debut. So a few, uh, few cards there. All right, we got Heritage High Number from 2018. 2018 Heritage High Number. Got a shot for Ronald Acuna, Juan Soto, Shohei Otani, Glaber Torres, and some autos as well. Autos are very difficult in Heritage. Beautiful set here. Bud Norris, Carlisle. There's a Glaber Torres. It's a nice clean Glaber Torres, a little off center, left to right. But a really nice card. I think Glaber is pretty underrated in the hobby. You got a chrome parallel of Matt Moore. Reggie Jackson highlights. Jeremy Hellickson, Fernando Rodney, and Daniel Mengden. All right, 2018 Tops Update. 2018 Tops Update. You got a shot at Juan Soto, Ronald Acuna, Shohei Otani, Glaber Torres, Austin Meadows. Image variations are also a possibility. So, we got Dustin Fowler, Mengden again, Nottingham, Kevin Gossman, Scooter Jeanette, an insert of Bradley Zimmer, Logan Morrison, Nolan Arenado, Jose Abreu, and Craig Kimbrell. All right, couple packs left, guys. Including the 2019 Top Series 2. Series 1 did not have a ton of rookies, but Series 2. It's got Pete Alonzo, Fernando Tatis, Eloy Jimenez, and then a chance for Vlad Guerrero Jr., who is a bit of a short print. Let's see what we get in here. Kevin Newman, having a nice year. Steven Strausberg, Brandon Drury. Got a Willie Adamas rookie cup. Cam Gallagher, Steve Pierce, Carson Kelly, 150 years parallel, Jose Peraza, Brandon Workman, Dellen Batances, Stephen Wright, Andrew Benatendi, 
Andrew McCutcheon, and Andrew Triggs. All right, final pack. And this is a bonus. I think it said something one in every six boxes has a bonus pack. And so this is a 2019 hobby exclusive. It's a silver pack, so you get four cards in here. They're pretty nice. They got some kind of mojo shine to them. They're really neat looking cards. You can get color parallels. You can get autographs, but they're uh, they're not too easy. So we got a Max Scherzer, as you can see, incredible shine. Kevin Newman, Miguel Andujar, and Robin Yon. So some nice cards there. And that's it for the Rookie Card Explosion Box. Volume 7. So many possibilities. Sometimes you're going to crush it. Sometimes maybe not. But it is a blast. And it's a lot cheaper than going out. I mean, most of these products have gotten very expensive. If you were to go buy 2013 or 2015 update, I mean, they're going to cost you a ton. So this gives you a chance to kind of check everything out. Old stuff, new stuff. It's a look at the base I got. So nice stuff there. The best cards I did hit were, was it Glaber Torres from Heritage High Numbers? A Judge rookie debut. A Cody Bellinger home run derby. The D.D. Gregorius, which I'll take a look at. This nice little Verlander and a couple Hall of Famers in Nolan Ryan and Robin Young. So I had a blast. had a lot of fun. Uh, appreciate everyone watching it. Like I said, check out Filmington's channel. And let me know down below what you think of the Rookie Card Explosion Box. How do you think I did overall? And did you enjoy the video? Let me know, and I'll talk to you next time. Have a great one.